Well, I've, I've been drawing with pencils since I can remember. About nine years ago, um, taking some art classes, I um, was introduced to charcoal, and it just it just flowed smooth. Uh, smoothness of the charcoal, really, I, I found that I could get a lot bigger pieces blended the same way I could with graphite. Only I've, I've got tool, better tools to do. It. I used to use just my fingertip uh, for um, pencil or, or graphite. And with all the tools that I was introduced to with charcoal, I can blend a lot bigger areas and make them look smooth. And, and, and then over time of experimenting with ground up charcoal and, and different types of paper, um, I've been able to get it even smoother over the years. But I, I did my first portrait um, nine years ago, and I just loved, loved it. Um, I love people's faces, and I love seeing, capturing people's character in their eyes, seeing, uh, seeing especially faces that have more character to them. Well, I've, after that, I, I got married to my wife about five years ago, five years ago this July, and I, after that, I, I did another piece, another portrait, um, about three years ago, right before my first son was born. And I've had three babies since then, uh, uh, well, three, including him. And um, I, I was busy. I, I, I had to put it down. I didn't do anything for over three years. And, uh, after, and I only had two portraits until this July, I started started working again. Everything else in the tent it was done since since July. I mean, not July, January. The flowers that I that I chose I chose wilting flowers, and it, the it's titled September 20th. Um, we lost our second child on September 20th, um, and and it was a very emotional time for us. And the wilting flowers, I thought, caught that uh, that dreary, rundown, tired, and, and mourning feeling. And uh, so um, I got finished with those flowers, and I knew that the, the connection there was um, amazing. So I, um, the no, the non-portraits that I do. Um, are something that I really, really like, or something that really strikes a heartstring. Um, I'm working on one that's a portion of, of Notre Dame in, in Paris, and it's it's kind of got two different, you know, two meanings for me. I I started the sketch um, when I was in Paris on my one-year anniversary with my wife, and. Paris is the art capital of the world, and it's just such so rich. That Notre Dame is so rich. I mean, it's it's a it's literally a massive sculpture, and so um, it has to be something that's really unique, really, really has some depth to it if it's going to be a non-person.